All right. Now, moving back on to my first uh, argument. There is no standard for donation. Um, actually, the importance is placed on the spiritual values, not the material ones. The core value is giving a hand toward the improvement of life aspects, such as those that I have mentioned above. Uh, for example, education and um, health medical care. By doing that, we are also enhancing the life quality of ourselves, right? We do understand, we do understand that doing what you love will not always come with guaranteed outcome, guaranteed good outcome, positive outcome. But if we regret it, if we're starting to regret it, we lose this, we lose the the most important things of the choices you made it is choices that you made to improve yourselves improve yourself as a person improve yourself as a functional member of society as a contributor to people around you both both well for the well being well the well being and the physiology Because of nowadays, social media is one of the most essential part in our life. So if social media is a country, then it would be the biggest population in the world with 1.8 billion according to Facebook. So we do believe that the societies must have a dedicated regulation for freedom of speech. And we already have enough. I'll think that the restriction nowadays is not a so what is the benefit of following what we love firstly i think that you will have experienced the true feelings like when you do what you love maybe sometimes you feel happy disappointed or sad that is like a gift of emotion and you will be extra motivated if you're working like a machine or you don't like your job, maybe the feelings that you have only the negative one. If someone told me that, okay, maybe they want to do that job, but they don't have enough ability to do what they want. So when they can't not do it, they will give up easily. But what I mean is that we should, we should live and do what we want. <clears throat> it's okay if if we don't have ability, but at least we are trying, trying to do and trying to live in the things that we want. And if we cannot do it, we can still keep it as a hobby and we still keep continue to love it and doing it. If you meet an upstair, please slow down. Don't turn around. Always remind yourself, yes, I'm a slow worker but never backward and start with things that make you happy and love big dream big thinking always be proud and believe in yourself surround yourself with people who support encourage and trust you and don't mind those who reject or dislike you accept failure and learn from your mistakes most importantly do what you love and love what you do. Thank you.